we are from South Africa originally. We moved here in 2007. I got a job here in Tauranga and, uh, as a landscape architect. And we came with two little baby boys when we arrived and they're now uh, rather large 18 and 15 year olds running around. I think we pursued a new build initially because it actually works out cheaper in the, at the end of the day versus trying to buy a 10 year old property that you know that's been designed for somebody else and you sort of have to fit yourself into that kind of mold as best you can we built previously so we sort of knew that you know you can get closer to what you want for your own purposes and your own family really what i liked initially was as i made a few phone calls and said look i'm thinking of building a house um, can i have a chat with you guys and within like two days mark was on site himself out here with me and from there it just kind of worked out. Yeah, I think a key piece of advice for people building is basically that you need to find a company that you're comfortable with up front and, and talk to them about what your expectations are and kind of get a feel of if they're on the same page with that. Before you go to the designer or to a building company, if you haven't got, really got a design, get real familiar with what it is that you want and what it is that you like. And I think that's where classics, having that in-house design team is good because, you know, they bring that experience. So the kind of way we laid it out is that the kitchen looks out to the garden and everything looks out, but, but those central spaces were used for like um, scullery and storage and things that, um, you know, you don't need windows for and stuff. So kind of orientating the house that way means you, you're using all the space well and you're not um, using up external walls for a, for a room that actually doesn't need windows and stuff like that. So it maximizes how many windows you can have. I think the house has just created a much more sort of connected environment. It's, um, it's really functional and, and nice and open and usable, but it just means that, you know, if somebody's in the kitchen and somebody's out here in the living room, whilst on the deck there, they have a, enough separation that you can still communicate and it's, and it's well enough connected like that. And then if you really do want some privacy, you can, you know, head to the bedroom or head into the sort of media room and shut the doors that kind of thing but i think the main thing is the main living area here is just nice and open and, and it flows nicely out into the outdoor area and stuff and it's that flow and connection when you're socializing that you know there's a few spaces going on but everybody can communicate things so it's just a really sort of sociable kind of kind of layout we definitely would use classics again um the whole process was good and easy and it's it, you know it's nice to be able to you know, enjoy a drink with the, the building company afterwards and, and everybody's happy at the end of the day.